Today, back in solo queue. I know that I've been playing a lot of marksmen recently, it's just that they're really fun to play. And I swear I'll stop real soon, it's just that I want to play Beatrix before I do so. But I already played Beatrix a lot in the past, so why play her now? It's just uh, very simple, I want to try out playing like that Beatrix in the enemy team in my previous game who kicked my butt really hard. And she did it mainly with her shotgun, so we're going to go mainly shotgun today. Can we all agree that if you see these two things right in front of you, then that means you're doomed? Hey, that's, that's not what I'm talking about, I'm talking about Moskov and Inspire. Now that we are in the game, we're just going to hang out and chill in our tower while we have our sniper rifle. Because I don't think we can bully Moskov, especially when all he needs to do when he's low HP is to press his Inspire. God, I really hate how they made Inspire overpowered, especially when this guy already can do that. Did he just dash through my bullet? Yeah, he's just gonna keep pushing us out every time we try to engage him, won't he? Now this is getting a little more exciting. We got Franco here, but this Moskov also has Hanzo lurking around. But Franco knows all about his ninja tricks, and I am here to make sure that whatever he started ends up in a happy ending. And that can only be accomplished once we take down that ninja and also this Moskov. That was a great hook. But I don't think we have enough damage in our shotgun yet, but who needs a shotgun when you have Balmond securing our kills? Come on, Moskov, fight like a man, or is this how men fight wherever you came from? I played Moskov recently, but I never do this. Maybe I should start doing this just to annoy my enemy, right? Like dash in and then push the enemy away. Oh, what do we have here? A low HP one-shot Karina who is now still alive. Now that's gonna be a big problem, so let's fix our mistake. Turtle soup time and it looks like Franco is dressed for the occasion. And the occasion is to butcher Moskov. As soon as he stops doing that crap, then maybe we could take him by surprise. But this time, we're going to run away really fast in the opposite direction because this Yin is looking at me with malicious intent. Yo, why do we have Esmeralda here now? I wasn't done dealing with Moskov. Oh, but it looks like he hasn't forgotten about us because he just wasted his ult on this lane. Meanwhile, this Esmeralda is getting a little bit too close to killing me. Oh god, do I still have HP? Yeah, we still have 1 HP, but I'm afraid if we stop, a fly might land on our head and that would be the end of us. So let's just keep walking towards the base. Alright, I guess that's it for our bot lane with the power of Moskov and Esmeralda's teamwork. They have taken down my tower. So that only means we're gonna have to take something away from them as well. How much does a tower cost right now? I think it's equivalent to one jungler enemy. Now that the dead has been paid, it's snack time again and the snack for this time is still turtle soup. Get him boys, if Moonton won't nerf him, we're gonna have to do it ourselves. Okay, nice hook, nice attempt, but uh, right now I gotta get away from here. But we are not fully retreating because our teammates are here. Everyone's here and Hanzo has joined the party. Wow, this looks like it's turning out to be an easy game. It's not even 10 minutes yet and we're already banging on their inhibitor tower. But we ran out of minions and my lane at the bot lane needs some sort of cleaning. Too many minions there now. Uh-oh, I think my teammates need some help. They're getting chased by Yin and Esmeralda. Ooh, nice catch there, Franco. Just uh, hold him down so I can take him down because he only has 1 HP. Uh, how, how the... F okay, guys, now is a good time to comment down any tips into getting out of Yin's infinite punching stunts once he gets you. Purify might work, right? But uh, I don't know. But what I do know is we need to take down this lord as fast as possible. It's a good thing that our jungler is now here and he ults it. Very nice secure. Now let's take it easy and not fight them because your ult is on cooldown. Okay, you wanna push mid? Alright, I'm just gonna hang around this bush and that is the wrong bush to hang around in. Mr. Yin, it's you again doing some nasty stuff to the victims of your ultimate. Well, who's the victim now? I'll give you a clue. It starts with a Y. It's your mama. 11 minutes and we're right here. We're definitely gonna take down this tower, right? There is no way that they are gonna be able to defend against that. But I have a feeling that this lord might not be enough to end the game yet because it's not the empowered one. And they do have that Moskov who can clear minion waves really fast. Hey, 
What do you plan to do with that little girl, you pervert? I don't want to get ulted though, so I'm just gonna wait for you here once you're done. I probably could have taken him because I have my shotgun, but who knows? I really thought that Nana could get away since she had Molina, but I guess that's a no-go. And now I'm gonna need to get out of here. But Franco is here, and I'm not gonna abandon him. In fact, I'm going to feed the enemy Moskov. What the heck am I doing? Come on, Franco, you got it. Oh wow, that is a 300 IQ move. I'm very impressed. Hmm, it might be just me, but I feel like the enemies are catching up slowly but surely. They have taken down all of our towers in the side lane except the inhibitor ones. And they actually got the Lord on their side this time, and it's marching towards our top lane tower. Alright, as long as someone covers my back and makes sure I don't get kidnapped by some pervert, then uh, we're gonna be fine. Just take a deep breath and take down the Lord. And by taking down the Lord, I meant this Moskov because he's the Lord of all bullshit. And that's that. Three enemies are dead and we have cleared our lanes. It's just a matter of pushing these minions up so that we can move around the map without worrying about our towers. Or maybe we can try to take this a little bit further. Clear this minion waves out? Okay, maybe not. But we got the attention of the enemy team, so our other teammates are free to do whatever they want. And this Moskov is also free to do whatever he wants. In the afterlife. Oof, we got minions here now, but if this Esmeralda jumps on me, which he didn't, so I'm just gonna take down this tower, just to make sure that we have two lanes with mega minions. Just give me a sec, I gotta do a little ghost busting here because Franco is getting haunted by his dark past. Maybe we should stop clearing the waves, I don't know. Wait a minute, is that a Karina with the roaming emblem? They have a Karina playing as the support slash tank. Okay, we might be in another universe again. This is uh, Earth number 69 and I've been here before. Oh no, they got the Lord again. With the power of Moskov's late game, that's uh, gonna be a really fast kill on the Lord. But that is fine. All we gotta do is stay close to the base and stick together as a team and make sure that we don't get picked off. Yeah, just, just like that guy. Wait, what? We're surrendering now? Come on guys, you guys must be kidding. It's late game now, I have my shotgun, I have some items, and I'm not afraid to use it. So all we gotta do is uh, really just that. Just clear the minion waves and wait for the Lord to get to our base so we can safely... Shut up Yin, I've already called the FBI. They're on their way. Um, guys, I might need some help here. I can't really change into my machine gun right now since I'm in the middle of a battle against the Lord here. But I can't leave this Lord alone as well to help my teammates because it's uh, gonna get to our base. It's a good thing that they brought the team fight here because now we can just stay back while safely taking down the Lord. Unless all of the enemies dash in of course. But that's fine, I'm still alive and Moskov, thank you so much for the little push. I'm gonna make sure that I don't waste this opportunity that you just gave me by making sure that you guys get what you deserve. Which is a nice vacation in the afterlife while you wait to be resurrected back to your base. Okay, same as before, push out these minions so that they won't take down the tower while we're not looking. And then we're gonna go help our teammates because it looks like they're lacking some damage here. How are they gonna take down this Esmeralda if she takes me down first? Oh crap, she's not alone after all. I guess it's time for me to get out of here. Ooh, nice hook. I don't think I'll be joining that team fight again because Hanzo is uh, trying to end the game, I see. So let's head over to our base and make sure he doesn't succeed from what he's planning. Remember when I said that uh, this might be a short game? Yeah, me too. Now it's 20 minutes. And the enemies don't even have a proper tank. They only have this Karina who build roaming items but is also building full magic items, I think. Can we take down this Lord now or do I need to go back to base to defend against Yin on our top side of the base? Oh, never mind. Franco went back home and Nana is there. And if you look at the map, you'll see that Moskov and Yin are on their way here to witness us take down this very strong Lord. Okay, nice. Nice knock up from the Lord and follow up with Yin. Didn't know that they had teamwork. Oh no, our jungler, Baldmund. Oh crap. Um, yeah, he's gonna die there, isn't he? And it's gonna be just Franco and Nana defending our base. We have Lord though. And the enemies are having their base chipped off by our minions. I swear, this fight is uh, driving me nuts. Just hold on guys, just keep defending and oh crap. 
let's uh, nope out of there and head on to the mid lane where we see a dead Deeroth. So that's a minus one for us, but he took down Moskov along with him. So that's a minus five for the enemy team because Moskov's like an entire team late game. Hey, catch him, he's getting away. Okay, Nana, no need to scream. I'm going to defend the top lane for you. I wonder how many Lord has been taken down and summoned in this entire game. You probably do. Meanwhile, we're gonna have to postpone that because I need to help my teammates with some damage here. Okay, now where did that Moskov go? Oh, he went back to base. I'm pretty sure that we don't have to take the Lord down now because none of us are dead and most of the enemies are. So let's just head over right into their base where I can run away from this Yin, not me again. Shut up Yin, oh crap, kidnapper number 2 is here trying to do what Yin is trying to do. But alas, there's only one of him and five of us so this game has now come to an end. A very good ending because we got our victory selfie. And it's a Running Man Moonwalking version too. I couldn't ask for more. And that's gonna be our Beatrix game once again. We had a lot of fun today, mainly using the shotgun while using the sniper from time to time. And I can feel and confirm that Beatrix is still top tier in the meta today. So that is it for me once again. My name is Shin Mentagazo. I hope you are staying safe, taking care of yourself, and staying healthy. Hit like if you enjoyed this video. Check out our recent uploads if you want to see similar content with different heroes. Subscribe if you want more of these in the future. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.